Hey yo, what up people? This is your boy Jay Sanjay Kicks and today guys, I'm gonna show you how do I lace my shoes. This is the way I like to, to lace my shoes, but I'm gonna show you how do I do it on today's video. And not only this way, but three different finishing touches for the lace towel. Um, yeah, what else can I say? That's what we're gonna do. But first, let me tell you that this dope shoe that I'm gonna use for these um, lace tutorial, it's called the Lucky Green Jordan 1. This one right here is a sleeper for real. The quality in this is really good. The color black in is amazing. And the colorway is actually nice, nice, nice. The Lucky Green Jordan 1 is a dope shoe to have in the collection. But that's only my opinion, guys. Now, let's go into this um, lace tutorial video. But before we go into that, if this is the first time you're watching my video, please let me ask you to go and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Activate the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I upload a video, which is every single day, guys. So, so go follow me on my Instagram and on TikTok as Jason J Cakes. And now let's begin this tutorial. Okay, so now that we have the shoes here, I'm gonna use the green laces, which are the laces that the shoe comes with. Um, we also have a pair of black laces, but yeah, for this video, I'm gonna use the green laces. First thing you gotta know is that um, you gotta make sure that both of the laces are um, the same size, you feel me? You don't want uh, one, one side looking uh, larger than the other, you want both of them looking the same exact size so yeah after that what we're gonna do is go um hole through hole i know it sounds weird but yeah that's what we gotta do that's what we gotta do so yeah make sure the laces are flat perfectly flat i'm gonna try to do the the loose lace you know to, to make the the shoe look a little bit better with a little bit of flow this is the way i like it you can have your personal um, preference of lacing your shoes, but I'm going to use the loose tile lacing method. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. So it's pretty, pretty basic the way I do it, but what can I say? This is the way I like it. Wait, where's the hole? Okay, cool here. So like I was saying, this is the way I like it. So what, what can I say? What can I do about it? I like doing the, the basic tile, but I think it's the best one. I like the way they look like this. Like, like I said, um, pay attention to these because you gotta make your, your your laces look flat and leave a little bit of space for the shoe, you know? You don't want your shoes to be extremely, extremely tight, at least I don't want to. If you want to, it's, you know, it's your preference. You can do it, you can do it the way you want to, but me personally, nah, that's not something I wanna do. That's why you can see here that I leave a little bit of room to my laces. Um, if you're asking, uh, I like to have my laces in 72 inches because I can um, give different finishes to the, to the shoes, the way I lace my shoes. Because if your laces are shorter than 72 inches, yeah, you're probably gonna, gonna struggle um, doing the lace well because you won't have dash more room to play with the laces. That's what I'm telling you. That's what I'm telling you. Right here, some people don't mind about these, but the tongue has a, a little bit of a, a tunnel, a hole or whatever here. Some people just pass on it. I like to, to put the laces through it. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do here. And Okay, I'm struggling a little bit, but yeah, that's normal, it's okay. Then, I'll just go to the, to this hole here. And here is where I mostly stop, because here is where I take the decision of um, which finishing lace style I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna show you that. But let me put this one first. Okay, okay. Like I said, guys, it's, it's depending on what sh what you want to do, what you want your laser to look like. That's just it. It's not that complicated. Just make sure the lasers look flat, because uh, if not, they they not gonna look that good. They're not gonna look that good. So right here, 
you can have the decision when you have the, the, the laces like this, you can have the decision of um, tying the laces here. Like, let me do it, let me do it, let me do it right quick. You can tie the laces right here, just like this. I like to do it like this sometimes. Um, yeah, you can just tie the laces here. Hold on, I'm on it, I'm on it, I'm on it, stay with me, stay with me, yeah. So just like this, you can tie the laces here and just leave it like this. I like this way, I like this way as well. Sometimes I just leave my shoes like this because I like it. Or you just can um, go to the next, to the next um, eyelid here. That's what you gotta do. There's here, again, two more ways, two more finishing ways. You can put the laces here and let them fly. Let me put the other one. Just like that, you can let the laces fly. You see, that's why you want your laces to be the largest as they can be, because you can play a little bit more with the laces. So you can let the laces fly like this, or just simple way. This is the way I use them the most. But that's again, my personal preference. Put it through the inside of the eyelid. And just like that. Okay, this is the way you're gonna see most of my shoes. Looking really clean, really clean. This is the way I like to do it the most. I show you my three, um, my three favorite um, finishing lace tiles, and I already show you the way I lace my shoes. A lot of you are always asking me, how do I lace my shoes? This is the way I do it. This is the way I like to do it. This right here is a sleeper, man. This lucky green is a fantastic shoe to have in the collection, a classic shoe. The Celtics one, the DMP, Jordan ones, whatever you want to call them, this is a sleeper. I love to have this in the collection. I'm pretty happy with my pair. The quality is amazing. And yeah, this is a how to lace video where I'm showing you how do I lace my shoes because a lot of you ask me how do I do it. Yeah, this is the way I do it. And this is one of my favorite finishing touches of the lacing style that I do. I show you the three best way in my opinion. Let me know in the comment section which is your favorite. And if this video was helpful for you in any way, make sure to leave a like, leave a like, and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Thank you a lot, guys, for watching. And until the next one, goodbye.